Bro, I never one time got upset with Hogan for playing his creative control card. Bro, WCW gave it to him. Mm, yeah. Why would I get hot at the guy for playing it? it, it Siri, I had, bro, I had no heat whatsoever for Hulk pulling that card. <laughs> Bro, I got to tell you something, man. Like, I, I swear to God, bro, I, I I saw the headlines and I'm like, I'm not. Are we going to go through this again? But, Chris, you will not believe how many people emailed me, DM me. Oh, Vince, you got to comment on this. You got to comment on this. You got to comment on this. Here's the problem, Chris. I'll be honest with you. Here is the problem. Supposedly, Hogan made these comments on Bubba the Love Sponge after the incident and they're just resurfacing. Mm -hmm. Oh, and statute limitations. Yeah, well, whatever. But here's my problem, bro, is, bro, a lot of what Hogan is saying is incorrect. But I don't know if he was working. Mm -hmm. It's like it was right after the incident. So he very well could have been working. But here's the part that pisses me off, and I'm sure you two guys will understand this. I was reading the article on Wrestling Inc., okay? And and the guy was trying to phrase it in such a way that Hulk Hogan played his creative control card and Vince Russo got pissed off and Vince Russo got very frustrated. Bro, I never one time got upset with Hogan for playing his creative control card Bro, WCW gave it to him. Mm, yeah. Why would I get hot at the guy for playing it? it, it Siri, I had, bro, I had no heat whatsoever for Hulk pulling that card. The heat was with WCW. If you guys are stupid enough to give a talent creative control, you better believe he's going to play the creative control card. So, bro, I never had a problem with Hulk pulling creative control the the only thing that was unsettling to me was before we got to bash at the beach i was told by john laurenitis that hogan agreed to the script we checked everything out with him first because we knew he had creative control so i'm walking into that building thinking we're we're all fine he signed off, off on it. He gave it his approval. And then literally two hours before the show, I'm getting out of nowhere. This doesn't work for me, brother. So if, if I had any beef, it was just the fact that, bro, you agreed to it on Friday. And here we are on Sunday and you're changing your mind two hours before the show. So, so to me, that was the unprofessional part of it but i never i never got hot at the guy for playing his creative control card when wcw gave it to him so to bring people up to speed who don't know what was the initial original finish that hogan agreed to the the original finish first of all bro he he uh, x-nade the first one okay, okay i wrote good. i wrote the first script he x-nade it so i well, said okay was that to put Jarrett over him? What was the first? What was the original? Bro, in every script, Hogan was King Kong. Okay. He was wiping out Jarrett. Bro, I had him wiping out Jarrett. I had him wiping out Steiner. I had him wiping out everybody, but he was not leaving with the WCW title. Gotcha. Okay, that, that because we had already agreed Booker's winning the title. Okay. So, br- bro... He, he could have killed the entire locker room if he wanted to. Mm-hmm. He's not. He wasn't leaving with the title. So he. So was him putting Booker ever an option there? What was him putting Booker over ever an option, or was it Booker was over? Was it supposed to be Jared putting Booker over from the beginning, or was Booker ever an option to Bro, be put over by Hogan? Honest, honestly, I don't remember. Okay. But th- th- this was this was where it came to this. He wanted to leave that building with the title. We had already agreed, all of us, 
Booker was leaving that building with the title. So as far as I was concerned, bro, you could do whatever you want. You're not win- you're not winning the title. We're, we're not doing that. So the, the 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 part that he agreed to was, like I said, bro, he laid out Jared, he laid out Steiner, he was literally King Kong, but he didn't win the belt. Then he agreed to that. Then I show up to the building. And he's got this great idea now. And how did the idea end? I'm leaving with the title. And I'm and I'm like, you're not. Like, no, bro, you're you're not. And that that's when I presented, you know, plan B. EC3, you got it. You got a thought on that? No, uh, because I was researching what was said here, and I didn't know if it was some sort of dumb racist thing he did again. But no, it's just about booking wrestling, so that's cool. he wasn't the champ, though, right? He no. was, Jared was the champ. Right. And then, yeah. okay, I remember this. And then he came out, he pulled the hijinks, and you came out. Then Jared and Booker had the match at the end of the show for the title. Is that right? Because he because he threw the title out, right? Because Jared had the title. Jared laid down for Hogan. Hogan yeah. won the title, and then he threw it out. He right? gave it the face. No, 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 no. Hogan won the title. Yeah. And I went out. And I said, bro, you can enjoy your title. You can put it up on your mantelpiece. You can do whatever you want to it because that title don't mean nothing. Oh, yeah, because you the yeah, real you, title you, is okay, going. Yeah, because, yeah, bro, yeah. my whole thing was I just had to figure out a way to get us back <laughs> to Booker winning the title. That's what, That's it. That was the whole thing, bro. And you vacated the title right after Hogan won. Yes. To get yes. Booker over. <laughs> that's you know, very nice. Very nice. I was, I was loved. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. I would have loved to see a motivated Hogan putting over a hot and up and coming Booker. That's team. see, that's that's that exactly what I was with you, bro. Was I'm with you. I would have <laughs> that would have been it right there. And nobody deserved it more than Booker, bro. I agree. No, nobody, nobody, bro. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. When Hogan wanted to go too, like he could still pull him out. Like, yep. Just with the, he was leaving too at the time, right? Not no, not necessarily. Not 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 necessarily. No, 